Welcome to Barbara Azul Nature Reserve. Asociación Armonía created Barbara Azul to protect the critically endangered blue throated macaw and the Beni Savanna in Bolivia. The Beni Savanna ecosystem covers an area the size of Texas or Portugal. Armonía can securely claim that Barbara Azul Nature Reserve is the only protected Beni Savanna climax community in Bolivia. Everywhere else, the habitat is not considered of conservation importance and is frequently burned and overgrazed for introduced exotic megafauna, cows. Along with the blue-throated macaw, visitors to Barbasso Nature Reserve often see cocktailed tyrant, sharp-tailed grass tyrant, black-masked finch, streamer-tailed tyrant, Ibera seed eater and the greater Rhea. The average bird watcher sees a hundred bird species in a day. See the eBird hotspot for a complete list and the seasonal listings. The protected habitats in Barbasul offer higher mammal populations where visitors see giant anteater, pampas deer, maned wolf, collared peccary, Kuwati, black howler monkey, gray brocket deer, marsh deer, capybara, large black caiman live in the river, and Barbasul has a wide diversity of dragonflies, frogs, butterflies, and plants. Barbasul has 21 miles. 33 kilometers of maintained trails through Cerrado, forest, and seasoned savanna habitat, a marsh boardwalk and blind, river boat rides, and horseback riding. Please let us know beforehand if you would be interested in horseback riding. We do not have staff guides. If you want bird or mammal guides, we recommend you plan your trip with a tourism agency that offers these services. We may be able to recommend a guide, but this would be an extra cost outside of Armonia's Barbasol Reserve visiting fee. We have four twin bed isolated cabins with private washrooms and hot showers, and two twin bed glampings with a shared toilet and shower. We can accommodate a maximum of 12 visitors. We offer a dining hall with three meals a day with a vegetarian vegan option. Everything is serviced by a silent 24-7 solar system. We work diligently to safeguard this ecosystem with 45 kilometers of fire breaks, fencing and constant maintenance, low impact cattle management, park guard protection and scientifically verified restoration projects. We offer tourism visits where your support goes directly towards conserving this critically endangered ecosystem and its flora and fauna. Please consider becoming an amigo of Barbasu to help maintain this essential area. When is the best time to visit? That all depends what you want to see. Lots of bird species July and August, as the area fills with winter austral migrants birds that migrate to Bolivia from Argentina. You can observe large numbers of blue macaws from April to September. During the dry season, August to October, there is a greater concentration of mammals near the Ami River. October is usually the driest period with the highest concentration of mammals along the river Ami. However, as many areas around Barbas will burn their grasslands, there may be smoke and smoky days. May and June mark our autumn characterized by occasional rains and mild temperatures. This is an excellent time for nature photography as the skies are usually clear and there is no smoke from grassland burning. Singing and displaying birds are better November to January. Bolivia, although situated in the tropics, exhibits strong seasonal variation. Bolivia's winter is opposite to that of northern latitudes. The rainy season occurs from November to April, when much of the Beni Savanna is flooded. Barbasul is visitable during this period. 
All trails in the Savannah and Cerrado regions are affected by seasonal flooding. As a result, they may become challenging to walk on at the end of the rainy season, May to June, until they can be properly cleaned in the dry season. Most trails are dry by July. April to September coincides with Bolivia's winter, so there is a possibility of a southern cold front that typically brings a few hours of rain and then several overcast days with cooler temperatures around 17 to 22 Celsius, 60 to 70 Fahrenheit. But there can be days as low as 10 Celsius, 50 Fahrenheit. Almost all visitors access Barbasol by a chartered Cessna plane from the city of Trinidad. We have a dirt runway, so flights might be delayed during and after rain, which is more likely during the rainy season. Plan a rainy season visit with a level of flexibility. Sometimes the Trinidad airport closes due to poor visibility. You will have a 20 minute walk from the runway to the lodge. Barbasul staff will transport your luggage from the runway to your cabin. Barbasul has many spare rubber boots that you can borrow. Please confirm your shoe size before arrival. If you are bringing your own rubber boots, make sure they are thoroughly clean to avoid introducing microorganisms. Be aware of the risks when visiting Barbasol. This highly diverse tropical habitat presents some potential hazards you should be mindful of. The venomous lancet snake has been found in the area. Jaguars and pumas inhabit the area and could potentially be dangerous. While we have never had problems with these species, please avoid approaching them, especially if you come across their young. No cases of a malaria, dengue fever, chikungunya have been recorded at the Barbasol Nature Reserve. These diseases usually require concentrations of humans, so the remoteness of Barbasol makes this possibility very rare. Malaria is very rare in areas visited by tourists in Bolivia. The blue-throated macaw is not a permanent resident of Barbasol Nature Reserve. They are abundant in Barbasol from April to early October, but typically migrate north to breed from mid-October to early February. Mammals are much more challenging to spot than birds. There can also be an element of luck in seeing certain species. For a unique mammal viewing experience, we recommend traveling in small, silent groups without bright colors and moving slowly. It's advisable to bring a wide-brimmed hat, insect repellent, sunscreen, and a flashlight torch. A light rain jacket or umbrella could come in handy. Generally, people wear long sleeve shirts and long pants, trousers in the field, and lighter shorts and shirts at the base. We offer free potable water, coffee and teas, and native unsweetened fruit juices. Beer and soda is also available for a fee at the bar. Daily cabin cleaning is not provided due to our limited staff availability. However, for stays longer than three days, cabin cleaning can be arranged upon request. We do not offer clothes washing service. From the base, you have a walking access to all the main trails. You will be provided with a map and can explore all the major habitats in the area. You can cross the Omni River on a pontoon, which is located in the middle of the boardwalk. Please remember that your visit grants you the privilege of experiencing one of Bolivia's most important wildlife conservation projects. Your support plays a vital role in its protection. You can also support our efforts with the souvenir shop. Consider becoming a Barba Sur Amigo and if possible, directly supporting Armonia's conservation work. Let us know before you visit if you have any food allergies or specific needs and if you would like to borrow boots and your shoe size, and if you would be interested in horseback riding. We look forward to seeing you.